This is EVB Live. Can you believe it? The year is winding down. In fact, it's going to be October soon. I can't believe it. It's hard to believe. Holly Henbest, our real estate expert, here to talk about the state of the market so far. We're talking about snowbirds. They're coming. And Yay. if you want to be in the market for them, we've got some tips. But first, let's start with what you're seeing with the state of the market so far, Holly. It's been a phenomenal year. It continues to be record-breaking sales versus 2014, and mm -hmm. we're going to finish strong is my prediction. What's driving this? Well, I think overall we thought that this year was going to be a very stable year of recovery and resetting of the market back from way back when. And it's really rung true. Last Last year we had some nice recovery and this year I think there was so much pent up demand from the last several years and now sellers have risen in price so they're able to get out of their home and get onto that next step in their life so we've really stabilized and normalized now it's great. And the interest rates are kind of good too. Yes right? they are and the Fed announced yeah, last that's week right. they're, they're not, not touching them it. so we like that so news gonna, in real estate. It's going to continue. Yes. Alright some folks want to sell their home uh, maybe it's on the market now what should they do right now as we approach the fall? Well if you're on the market now or you're thinking about selling seize the moment because the next 60 days are going to be the busiest through the end of the year. We mm. always start to see a lull in December and we Holidays. see that in sure. January, both in 2015 and 2014, January was the slowest sales month of the year. Mm. That means the month before or the 45 days before is when things start to slow. So if you're wanting to sell, you need to really push it now and really step up your marketing in terms of if your home is something that would be attractive to a snowbird, make sure that the pictures in your listing and also the verbiage in your listing are really highlighting those attributes in your home that a snowbird would love. Are you finding a difference from the snowbirds that come from the Great White North, like Canada, as opposed to maybe the Midwest somewhere? Are the Canadians, yeah. do they have a special thing that, that might find attractive for them? Well, years ago, you know, back in 2006, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, we saw a huge influx of Canadian buyers. And I mean, it was always the joke that it was really Canada season, not snowbird <laughs> right, season right. in the real estate market. Right, right. But now it truly is snowbird season because we've seen the Canadian buyer really diminish. Just in the last few months, we've only only, we've sold less than 200 homes in the Phoenix area to really? Canadians, whereas at the height of the market in 2011, we we're right around 1,500 a year. So we've really seen that market diminish, and what we've seen is more U.S. buyers coming mm. here. We tend to attract a lot of people because of our price and our weather, weather and all of the amenities that go along with that weather. So right now is the time, you know, today's the first day of fall and as I left for the studio, my son was still in the pool and <laughs> people in other parts of the nation are starting yeah. to dust off their winter coats. So they're going to see our weather here continuing to be beautiful and this is where they want to be, not only for the weather but the golf, the views, the spas, our restaurants are fantastic here. So while people may get a little bothered by the increase in traffic of snowbirds coming, mm -hmm. it's a great boost to our economy me plus a great boost to the real, real estate market. Okay, so one big tip before we let you go as far as somebody that might be watching and think about these people that are now going to start coming into the valley again. Give me one tip for them. Be flexible. Okay. Snowbirds are here on vacation. They don't do a ton of planning of their time and they get very spontaneous and excited when they see something and want to look right away. So be prepared for that and be flexible for those showings. Keep the house tidy. That's Be ready to have them come on in and say, yes. yeah, all right, we're ready to sell. Please do, yes. All right, Holly, always great to see you on Wednesdays. Thank you Lots so of much. fun. It's Thanks. a Holly day when she's here, is it Yay. not?